The woman accused, accused of driving drunk and hitting and killing a Fort Worth sergeant was out on probation when that crash happened. Hello, everybody. I'm Heather Hayes. And I'm Steve Eager. It's 9 o'clock. She'd previously been convicted, as Heather just mentioned, for shooting a significant other. The suspect pleaded guilty to aggravated assault for that, and she'd been under strict guidelines, including no alcohol use. Meanwhile, there was a procession today for Sergeant Billy Randolph. His body sent to the funeral home. A memorial will be held tomorrow. Fox Sports Peyton Yeager in Fort Worth tonight with more on all of that. Peyton. Steve and the Fort Worth Police Department announced today that Sergeant Billy Randolph's funeral is set for this Saturday at 10 a.m. As for the suspect in this case, the court documents show that she waived her right to a jury trial just four months ago in April, and then she was sentenced to community supervision. Police say 25-year-old DeAudelay Evans was on probation when she got behind the wheel drunk early Monday morning. Fort Worth Sergeant Billy Randolph was working a crash on I-35W when Evans drove the wrong way on the exit ramp, hitting and killing the 29-year veteran. A blood test is still pending. Fox 4 pulled Evans' previous mug shots from Tarrant County. According to court documents Fox 4 obtained on Tuesday, Evans pleaded guilty in April to aggravated assault with a deadly weapon and unlawful carrying of a weapon. Records reveal Evans shot a woman in 2023, her romantic partner. Evans was sentenced to six years probation. Her conditions included do not use, possess, consume any alcohol. A judge also ordered Evans to complete a batterer's intervention and prevention program. Tarrant County Commissioner Manny Ramirez posted on social media Tuesday, Evans shot her girlfriend with a handgun in 2023. Going on to say this is what happens when society demands zero accountability for those who commit violent and dangerous crimes. Now Evans sits in jail facing intoxication manslaughter of a peace officer. It's with a very heavy heart that we have to open our meeting tonight in honor of Sergeant Billy Randolph. Fort Worth Mayor Maddie Parker made remarks about Sergeant Randolph at the start of Tuesday's city council meeting. We were reminded yesterday that he did not have to be doing the job he was doing. He could have been retired somewhere. He certainly did not have to work midnights, which he chose to work. And he was out there on I-35 with his men and women because he wanted to be right there beside them. Tuesday morning, the sergeant's body was brought from the medical examiner's office to a funeral home. And outside the South Patrol substation, there you go. Sergeant Randolph's cruiser continues to be covered in flowers and notes of gratitude. Stephen Heather, tomorrow would have been Sergeant Randolph's birthday. So tomorrow evening, there is an event here at the South Patrol Division. There's a prayer vigil. It starts at 7.30 p.m. Um, where the memorial is, his cruiser. Again, it's the South Patrol Division, the Fort Worth Police Department, and it's open to the public.